can't you see I see one or two people? Okay, hi guys. I'm just gonna put um fix this for my little secretary Shiloh. Okay, here I'm live here. So you just if I if there's any comments, Shiloh. You just um I just tell you, okay. Yeah, because I can't see the comments. Okay, so far we have okay, so we can start. I don't know who that is, I can't see who's that online. Oh, hi, hey, Michi. I'm showing you my Melaleuca stash. Yeah, that I ordered from last week. The stuff that I use in my house. Marsha's watching. You don't, you don't tell me everybody who's watching. Just, you know, what you want to pop on. Okay, so guys, I, I have to show you guys my Melaleuca stash that I ordered from uh, last week. Um, it's household, like everything household. Cleaning, laundry, snacks, um, vitamins. I got a new mop. Mishi said good morning. Morning, Mishi. Okay, so I'm going to start with, first of all, I made the boys um, snack packs. I'm going to show you one example of the boys snack packs that I did. Just before I start my, my, my thing there. So yesterday, it was a little bit of stuff that I had put in their um, thing. So today, there's a bottle of ice cold water. There's a juice box for some little added sugar. Although this is a... Yeah, excellent source of vitamin C. Then there's an apple. Then they have a yolk. Then Shiloh has some nut clusters. I'll show you guys that in a few seconds that I put in here. These here, very tasty. And then he has his fruits and veg, uh, not fruits and veg, his vegetables, his cauliflower and his carrots inside this here. So that's Shiloh's snack. That he has to rush in for the whole day. And Lucas' his own is a tiny bit different. So Lucas has a ice cold thing of water, um, yogurt, a juice box, an apple, and then uh, I'll show you guys this too uh, a bar, not no regular bar. And then he has his, um, his what do you call it? carrots and tomato in here with his ranch dip so that's his snack for the day so they don't have to go in the fridge they don't have to say they want water because everything is in their what do you call this in bucket snack box. snack box okay so that's that so that's out of the way okay so now this is the really exciting part i'm excited to show you guys up uh, well this is just this month's um stuff did anybody ask any questions because I can't really see Shiloh? Mm. So what's all those comments I see on the thing? Well, I don't see any. You don't see no comments there? No. How? Touch the screen. Oh. Okay. Alright. Okay, so so no questions so far, Shiloh? Nope. Shiloh's my little secretary that I give I give my other phone so he could tell me the comments that you guys write. Okay. So for the snacks, I bought these guys. Um Okay, this is one. This is peach praline. I'll show you guys an open pack. Hold on. So this one here, okay, this is mango coconut. And there's no artificial anything in this in these snacks here. I got them yesterday, but I just opened it like after midnight last night because I was so tired. So this is how it looks. This is how the simply fit. It, the camera's probably backwards, so you're seeing the letters backwards. But it looks like this. It's a nut cluster and it has mango, um, coconut, uh, pumpkin seeds, and cashews all clustered in this one little thing. Uh, and it tastes that good. So this is one. This is mango coconut. So that's what Shallow had in his um, snack pack. And the other one that I have, you want the rest of this? The other one that I have is peach praline. I didn't open this one yet because I don't want it to finish too quick. So that's why we gave Shiloh four clusters. Yeah. Darky Prime said, hey, hon, good morning. Hey, Darky, what's up? <laughs> okay. So I have three packs of this, I think. I'm supposed to have four, right? 
I must have my seed here. So I'm supposed to have two packs of the mango and two pack <coughs> two packs of the, the praline um thing. So that's for the boys. Yeah. I need to say, mm, I love I love the mango coconut. Yeah, those ones are the bomb. It's my first time actually tasting those, Anita. Um I'll definitely be ordering some more of those for the boys to put in their lunchbox or snack to eat at home because it's really healthy and there's no artificial anything in there. The next snack that I bought for them, I put one in Lucas's box, is the Chewy Snack Bar. Um, this had this one. This is yogurt parfait, whole oats and flax. So this is all natural. Um, it has grains. It has source of uh, um, omega, fiber, protein, low in sodium, no artificial colors, flavors, or sweeteners. So this is good. These, these bars are real. These ones I had before. So the flavors that I have is the um, yogurt berry parfait. And then I have another box, which is the vanilla Greek yogurt. So these two boxes, and in each box comes five, five bars. So the- Colleen says, hey, sister girl. Who? Colleen. Hey, sister Colleen. <laughs> Thanks for joining. You guys can press the share button if you feel like to share. I think something just flew out of my mouth, but who cares? It's probably a, a, uh, <laughs> CW Love said, CW Love said, wait, you can read with your glasses? No, I'm not reading. I have to have Shiloh as my eyes. He's reading um, on my other iPhone, so yeah. I prepared myself this time. Okay, so as for snacks for the boys, th those are it. Oh, and I bought Lucas this. It's called Attain. It's a crave blocker. So, because he always thinks he's hungry, but he's really not. So, this is, um, it reduces hunger, cravings to support healthy weight loss. So, we're going to be on that. 10 grams of protein, fiber, and it's only 120 calories in the whole um, thing. And this is their vanilla flavored. So, we're going to try this today. It looks like, like this. Okay, so that's that as far as consumption goes now onto the part where i really enjoy is the cleaning part oh before i get to the clean no i mm. forgot <gasps> okay sorry about that again i'm a little extra okay so i have one two three four five different teas in this box and there's there's 25 tea buys one two three four five. so that means five of each so there's melaleuca herbal there's a herbal one, there's tangy lemon, ginseng, apple berry, and herbal evening. I guess that one is for night. Marsha said, is that a shake? Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a shake, yeah. Okay, so there's five flavors. I had the apple berry this morning. Oh, you know when tea is supposed to taste like tea, when you put, put it in hot water and you actually taste the flavors? So that was what I experienced this morning. It's my first time sharing that flavor too. Dorothy Pride said, what is the name of that? The name of what? The tea? Darky, the name of what? The tea? Because, yeah. So, it comes in a, in a uh, thing like this. Could you stop doing that? Um, yeah, so nice flavors. I'm going to try the herbal evening one and see if I fall asleep. Because last night I had a wicked migraine. Okay, so it comes in this, so you can just pull it out, or you can open the box, hey, or or if you have a tea canister, you can just drop them in there, because they all have na their names on the, the box. So that's my tea. Okay, and another thing I want to show you guys is the mouth rinse. You know when you eat at night, like late at night, and you don't brush your teeth, and then you wake up in the morning, and your mouth is like, and it, uh, like, it, it tastes horrible? Yeah, so I bought the mouth rinse. Um, this is peppermint. This has peppermint, cinnamon bark, clove. And we all know clove is good for teeth. I have a teeth in the back here that's really bothering me and it's supposed to come out, but... Darky Prime said, what is the name of the shake? The name of the shake? It's called Attain. A-T-T-A-I-N. So, so lose, I don't want to lose no more weight because I lost weight already. And I didn't even try, so I don't know how I'm losing weight. So I'm not impressed. But Lucas is gonna try this one, um, and I'll see how it goes. If it if it works well, then I'll get him another one. There's a lot of different flavors, right, Nikki? 
Okay. I, I'll probably just drink it just like after a, um, a workout session or because we're going to do workout session at home too because I'm getting a little Oprah-ish on the arms. Okay, so this mouth rinse, like I was saying, has peppermint, cinnamon bark, clove, rosemary, and oh, myrrh. And then the added touch to this is T36C5 Maluka oil. And we all know tea tree oil in anything is good. So I'll try this after. And I'll let the kids use this. I could, it's closed, but I could smell the mint through the um thingy. There's a cover. Okay, so that's my for my bathroom. So, so far we had snacks, um, protein, we had tea, we had mouth rinse. Um, any more? Oh, and then this here. This here, I bought actually bought it for a friend. I didn't buy it for myself. It's um, it's like an antacid. It has natural calming herbs. You know, like when you eat and then you're, it feels like it's stuck right here, but you really don't have on no bra, but it still hurts. Yeah, so it's that's probably acid buildup or other stomach indigestion, uh, indigestion issues, and all that other stuff. So, um, it says to take one to two of these here. Shall I see a lot of comments, you know, there's nobody um, asking any questions? It says I will inbox more about it, but you know. Who said that? Um, Darky Prime. Okay. Okay, so this is, um, it's like an acid, it's called Comicid. Calmicid. And you take one to two to And supposedly it's supposed to, um, help with the upset, upset stomach or indigestion or, you know, those other issues with the stomach after you finish eating okay so that's that okay and then i bought this one here i i I'm, oh let me just show you these these are my laundry detergents and it comes and you literally i it's not my first time using this you literally just have to do one pump in your washer hmm? um calling Colleen said, is the mouth rinse ready to use straight from the bottle? Yeah, it is. It doesn't say to mix or anything. It just, if it, if it was, it would have told me. So. Oh, yeah. And CW said, hope you're paying me. <laughs> for what? Like me. Oh, for Sh oh, Shiloh? Yeah. No, he's doing it out of the love of his heart. Right, Shiloh? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, so this is ready to use. I guess you could just pour it in a little cup. And push it in your mouth, and, and I obviously you're gonna have to rinse after because you don't want the residual to stay in your mouth all day. I, at least I don't. But I'll try both ways. So this is Lucas. Do you want to put this in? This comes with a pump. Hmm? Colleen said, or do you need to mix it in the water and then use it? No, it doesn't say to mix. Lucas, just see, see that it says if it needs to mix. But no, I don't think it does. This here is uh, the pump for for this. So it measures it out, and you see these new pumps now, they give you a, a, um exact amount of the stuff that you need. So even when it's in the corner of the bottle, it sucks it up, and so there's no wasted product. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Lucas said it doesn't need to rinse. You don't have to mix it with water. So you just... um. It just says shake well before you use. Rinse mouth with about three teaspoons. Yeah, okay, so he says it says rinse your mouth with about three teaspoons, and that's it. So that's it. You put that in with three teaspoons, blah, 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 and then you spit it out, and that's it. So, Lucas, you could put this in, poke a hole in it, and screw it in, and I'll show them how the pump works. I don't know how come this pump looks. Is this bigger? Could be my eyes. Okay, so while Lucas is doing that, um, Marsha said, I want to try the detergent with, the, with her laundry. Yeah. Okay, well, Mar Marsha will. No, push it down, please. Just push it down, yeah, and then and then and then turn it. So Lucas put. You see how nice my kids are. They love just love to help me. <laughs> okay, so this is how it looks after. So literally, one pump in the washing machine, depending on how soily your clothes are. If it's just regular throw in the wash, obviously you don't need a whole bunch of soap because it's very concentrated. It's nine times concentrated. So you just, please don't shake the table. So you just um, pump it one time or two. I, I would put two. It has 96 loads. This little bottle is 96 loads, which you know how it shows. It, it's concentrated, naturally derived from 
naturally derived stain removers, triple enzyme, natural power, effective in cold water, and safe scent standard, whatever that means. This is Island Breeze. I would pump it, but I don't want to waste none because, you know, I love this stuff. So that's that. So I have three, I bought the three pot because I have a lot of kids in the house and they, I hope I didn't buy one cent of each. Island Breeze. This is Garden Lavender. So I have three of these. Okay, so there's the there, in there. And then the next one I have, guys, the Mellow Magic. Let me tell you, especially for floors, this is four times concentrated heavy duty cleaner. This is in replacement of like um bleach, ammonia, and all those other stuff. It's a it's a and you only need it's so concentrated. Marsha said do you have different scents for the detergent? I think there's like three different scents for the detergent. Those two, I have two. I kind of sworn I bought all three, but whatever. So I think there's like three um, scents for the laundry detergent. So this here, literally, if you're washing your floors, pour some in the cap and pour it in the water. Do not pour it like this because it is so, 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 so concentrated that if you pour it like this, it's going to... Make, like make the whole house bubbly like it's, it's that concentrated and this you could use on anything anything it cleans walls floors cupboards windows like inside the little part there where you push and open colleen said do you have a vip sister girl no not yet but i, I think i should <laughs> good idea colleen uh, and and the fridge and everything but this can basically clean anything it's a uh, Heavy duty cleaner, four times concentrated. So let me tell you, if you if you choose to um, purchase from this club here, um, Mella Magic, it cleans everything. See, it says add 15 milliliters to one gallon of water. Yeah, so that's that. That's Mella Magic, and this bottle I have one over there over my washer, and I had it since like last year, and it's just now just 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 finishing. So I got another one. Okay, the next thing I have here is um, Lucas. Give me one of the um, the dishwasher bottle under the sink. I'm gonna show them the difference. This one here is new for me. The laundry, uh, the the thing under the sink. I bought this basically for myself because the dishwasher liquid. Give it to me. Thank you. So this is the dishwasher liquid. I have like 20 bottles of this. And of course, it's um, recyclable. So the material is not that type of plastic where you have to, it's going to hurt the planet. Mm -hmm. recyclable stuff. Yes, Shiloh? Marcia said, what about the fab fabric softener? Uh, they have fabric softener. They have the, uh, the liquid fabric softener, the one for the dryer. Uh, of course, the laundry detergent. Plus the stain remover, the little tabs there that you throw in the water with the whites. Listen, we, Mel Luca has every, everything pertaining to, they even have the stain remover you could just rub on and let it soak and then you push it and put it in the washer and then it washes. Every, everything that the store has, um, Mel Luca has it. So all those stuff, yeah. So this is how the dish, dish washing liquid looks. I have every, every scent you could think of. I think there's like three scents. So I have them all over my, my, my washer. If you came to my house, if you've, if you've ever been to my house, you'll know how my cleaning stuff is like up there. It's pretty proper. So this is how it looks here. Just open the tab like this. This is the lemon, no, apple. Apple scented. And it really does smell like apple. So here is, this has that kind of thing. So for myself, I wanted to treat myself. Yes, Shiloh? Um... Marcia said sign me up and then Anita said they have a scent booster too for laundry. Yes, the scent booster, that one is amazing too. And it comes in a bottle just like the um the laundry detergent and the scent booster adds it <clears throat> it complements the scent of your laundry detergent. So you know when you wash your clothes and <clears throat> you want it to smell like you've just been washed? Well that helps with it. And then the um the sheet that you throw into the dryer. My dryer broke, it popped down. So we have to hang out our clothes. This I bought for myself. Look at this, guys. 
Yeah. Look how nice this is. And can you believe? <coughs> sorry. Can you believe this is for the kitchen? Yes. For and it has. Listen. My little game playing here. You see it? Um, it gets every ounce of fluid that is in the bag. Anytime I use my um my laundry church and I pump and I open it to see if I can get more out of the thing, there's nothing in there because it literally sucks all the stuff around the bottom. So Lucas is going to I bought this. This is new. This is a refill. And this is the lemon. I had I didn't see this one in any other sun. I think right now it's just lemon. So I'm gonna let Lucas um Lucas, you could pour this in. So it comes with, <clears throat> and this pack, it makes, it refills two bottles. Pour refill the dispenser on the new. Okay, yeah, so it makes two of those bottles, this, this in here. But that's okay because I have plenty of dishwasher, dish, um, liquid, um, in my, in my, um, thing over there. So here, Mr. Nine. Can you use the out water? No, just pour it in. I don't, sp oh, hold it properly. Um, I need to say I have that for the dishwashing, the dish, um, soap too. Yeah, they have dish, if you have a dishwasher, I have some in there, but I don't have no dishwasher. So if anybody has a dishwasher and they want it, you can have it because I ain't using it. I don't know why I bought it. I had it in there for like two years or two and a half years. I've never used it for because I don't have a dishwasher. So if anybody wants it, just inbox me now. You can have it. Okay, so this is for... What looks is putting. Look at this. Look how nice this is for the kitchen. And it goes with my stainless steel stove. So next I'll be purchasing a stainless steel fridge. I claim that fridge. Because I'm getting rid of this white one. I'm going to claim a stainless steel fridge. Yeah? Um, Colleen said one of the boys need to give you a glass of water. Why? I, I seem thirsty? Well, I don't know. Oh, oh, for my throat. Okay, yeah, Colleen, that's an everyday thing. I'm always... <clears throat> my father does it. I do it. I don't know. It's just a throat thing. Yeah, I'll get, actually... Uh, um, I'll drink water in a second. Thank you, dear. So this here will... Here, Luki. Don't put too much. So when you push it in, it'll overflow. And then we finish it. Give it to me a second. Show the lovely people. And then... Guys, Listen. You know how us Negro folks have, I don't know if it's something in the air or what, but we have major dry skin. Keep keep on top of the comments, eh? We have major dry skin. Even, okay, so let me speak for myself. If I go outside, if I'm home, I take a shower, I usually lay in bed and air dry. I ain't gonna lie, but I like to air dry because my showers are really hot and then I come out and then I'm weak and yeah, I just lay on the bed and air dry. Stop that. I just air dry, so um, my skin, moist, my skin's moisture gets a little lost. Even if I come out of the shower and I lotion right away and I go outside, I don't know where the moisture went. So I have dry skin. Shiloh has dry skin. Lucas has pretty good skin. He has the best skin in the house, actually. Shania has problematic skin. So I bought this for Shiloh. I don't take bath. Um, I bought him intensive skin therapy. Um, it, this too has um, melaleuca oil in it, T36, which is melaleuca oil. Um, it's like this, and you just need, it's a cap, it's, it's a cap like, it's a top like this. So we just turn on the, sh um, put some water in the tub. Huh? Yeah, and then we just, is there a white paper on it? Okay, yeah, there's paper on it. We just pour like maybe two, three drops in a tub. And sit in there, and then your skin's supposed to, um, I mean, with, with continued use, obviously. And then um, your skin's supposed to be, have some, retain some moisture, because it's, it's a bath oil. And it smells, I used to buy, I bought this, him, bought this for him, like, when I first started Melaleuca, it was like three years ago. And I never bought it back again, but this stuff, when he sits in the tub and comes out, he just has to pat his skin dry, and then lotion his skin, and that's it. It's very slippery. Why? Because it overflowed in. So here, look at look at look at this, guys. Wow. Yeah, and the red, the red um, what do you call it? The red liquid that I have of this, you could put it here. Where's the cover? The the red liquid that I have of this, it will match my kitchen because I have red tablecloth, 
red dish towel, red mat for where the, mm, the under the dishes. Red is my favorite color. So when this finishes, oh no, but yeah, I have the red one in there. I can just pour it in. Um, yeah, so that's how it looks. Ta -na -na -na. See how nice this, nice this is? Yeah? I need to set um, um, the Renew Bath Oil is amazing, so the body wash and lotion. And then Marsha said these products seem amazing. They are. What did I need to say about the, about the Renew? They also have the lotion, <coughs> which the boys have their own lotions in their room. What did Anita say about repeat the comment? Okay, so that's it for the. For she said the Renew bath oil is amazing. So is the body wash and lotion. Yes, the body wash. I forgot. See, so Malco has everything. The body wash you could just put on your sponge or your washcloth, or as we Negro folks call it, put on your rag, and just wash with it. And I'm telling you, this is no joke. This Renew thing has um, it's a good experience because if you have dry skin, eczema, and all them stuff, I use it on Shiloh's um mouth here because he's always uh, licking it so it gets dry his skin is it holds no moisture so we're gonna get back on track with that so now that he's off of school he has time to sit down in the tub read a book play with his cars whatever and then he'll come out and then lucas want to get him the renew lotion in the cupboard he can just sit in the tub with that and then he'll stand up and then he'll bathe in there actually and then when he comes out um he will use the renew lotion to um seal in that moisture you know like lock it in i thought he was gonna get you the big one lucas really get the get the big one it it it'll, here's a sample of the renew um and this one is finished too yeah the kids bring i pack one of these in a the kid's school bag so shower brings this to school and i tell him um, at least three times a day to lotion his skin because his skin is dry. This is how it looks, the, the, the house one. It comes with a nice pump. Uh, intensive skin therapy. And it has a nice, a nice scent to it too. So that's... My whole house is uh, uh, practically milka. But, I, but I'm going to show you the best stuff, stuff in a minute. Okay, so that's the... This. So these two go together. So you bathe in this. Sit down, light a candle, let it get into your skin. Come out, pat your skin dry. You may never rub our skin, cause. <clears throat> and then the renew lotion, just pump, and then lotion your skin like any other lotion. Okay, so, yeah. Um, um, Anita said try the hair, skin, nails, vitamin for me, like me. Oh, kids could take it to Anita, Lucas. Go in that cupboard and give me the hair, skin, and nails. Anything that says vital, vi vitality, or hair, skin, and nails, you get. Is my nails skin? Okay, Lucas is going to get that. Um, I was using the hair, skin, and nails, and I'm using the vitamin D tabs, actually, too. And I had, listen, I went to the salon, and my nails had to do, but then I took a scraper, and I scraped off the, the gel off my nails, and I took off the whole top layer of my fingernails. So, I damaged them so badly, I couldn't put anything. No, this is not hair, skin, and nails. This is the vitamin D3, and these are my, these are women vitamins. But I have the hair, skin, and nails somewhere, probably up in here somewhere, Lucas is going to look. But these are, and it has the, um, it's powered by Oligo. Oligo. That will, I'll, I'll, I'll explain in another, um, and then I like when I'm getting more in depth into the products, but these vitamin D3 save my look, look at my fingernails. Let me make sure they're clean. And these are not fake nails, guys. And don't judge me because the nail salon, the nail salons are closed, so I cannot refill my nails. Marsha said I really need these products. Yeah, I told you about the vitamins, Marsha. And then look at look at this. From from nothing, look at my nails now. And they're hard. They're growing back. And it's because I've been taking the vitamin D3. And the hair, skin, and nails are, are somewhere in there, but I just can't find it. And then I take women vitamins. These, I, I think I gave it to Gabrielle. I don't know if she still takes it. But these here, let me tell you. The vitamins for women, we all need vitamins. Because we're get, especially when you get close to, I know you won't believe it, but close to 50. 
So when you get closer to 50, your body goes through so much changes. Your skin gets dry. Um, your fluids in your body um, dry up. Not that, not me, I'm just saying. And then your eyesight starts to dwindle. Your nails get brittle. Your hair gets thin. All those kind of stuff. So it, it's important that we take uh, eat properly, drink lots of water, and if you need it, proper vitamins. Okay, so that's that. And then, guys, I bought a new mop. Where's my mop, guys? Okay, okay. Pass me um, Shiloh. No, I'll do this. I don't want it. Can I say hi? Wait. So, guys, this is my most exciting part because you guys know I'm into the cleaning like hardcore. So I got this mop. I wanted it for like since last, I wanted to get this mop since last year. And this is how it looks. Listen, there's the bottom. It comes with three pads. The washing, this is for floors when you're cleaning the floor. It comes off like this. It like, like a, Velcro. not Velcro, but this is how it looks in, in like to hold it. So we just put it on like this and we just press it. And then the liquid, listen to this. The liquid part, oh, and it has the handle, so you just scratch, scratch, and then you just mop the floor. It also comes with a, a, a polishing pad, and then the other pad is, um, so cleaning, polishing, what was the other one? Yes, Shallow? Um, Anita said renew lotion doesn't just moisturize your skin, it goes deep and actually heals your skin. Skin. Exactly. Thank you for that, Anita. It actually does. So, <clears throat> by the time the kids go back to school, Shiloh will look all brand new, all polished. Okay, so, I'm trying to remember what the other pad was for. There's one to clean. Oh, yeah, for dry floors. So, if you just want to swiffer, because, you know, sometimes the kids drop crumbs on the floor and we're anal about stuff under our feet. Me. So, we just, um, so there's a one to clean, one to, um, for dry floors, and the other one for polishing. So this here is the cleaner. It, the bottle seems small, but listen, this is how it works. This whole bottle, there, it says 12X right here. That's the amount of, uh, that's the amount of, um, cleaner you put in there. Just up from this, from this part here to here where the 12x is that's how much cleaner you put in there and the rest you fill it with water and then you're good to go so you know can you imagine how long this little thing is gonna last who knows well i i mop a lot so but i'll take time with it it's my first time we're gonna use it for the first time because shiloh is kitchen manager today i think tomorrow's lucas's turn so shiloh is Not going Okay, so tomorrow shot Shania's turn. But we don't have to mop every day. So, yeah. So, this is my new little friend. Look at this. Nice. Whoops. Whoops, I just spread my foot. Nice, comfortable handle. Easy grip. And then, <clears throat> um, it doesn't take much product. I tried some this morning. It does not leave the floor sticky. Like some of those other stuff. And then, when you're finished, you just take this off. Throw it in the washer. And you can polish your floor like once a week if you want. But the polish, did I not buy the polish? Oh, oh, here it is. This is, it's ready to use floor polish. Yes, Shiloh? Um, Colleen said, I'm going to do a live um, to show you ladies how to remove your gel polish and damage your natural nails. Yes. What, did I finish that story? Oh, yeah. So, so I took the thing, I took the, the, the scraper and I scraped off the top layer of my fingers so every time it grew back even an, a little bit if i if i touch something like a hard surface my nails just bend and then they would break right here at the at the root of the nail so i had no nail for like months and months so i was feeling so unworthy close out the cupboard i was feeling so crap because I, you know when you go out you know if you want a date or whatever and you're holding the glass and your nails are like crappy so you're like this all the time, even in the even in the car, you're like this. That's how I felt for like months, cause my nails were like broken. So I just didn't put no nail polish, no nothing on them. I took the um, the vitamins and listen, 
couple months later, look, look who has fingernails. Look, look at this. Look. And they're my real fingernails too. Okay, so back to where I was. Yeah? Um, Anita said, I'm almost 40 and I don't look it at all. When people ask what my secret is, I always tell them it's Malaluka. <laughs> well, true. Along with water and exercise. Yes, 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 yes. It's in the jeans, I guess. I don't know. But I'm, I've been, I got a scare maybe what, two years ago and I was like, uh, we can't take our health for granted no more because things happen and we might not, we might ignore it. But listen, I'm starting to take care of myself much better. I try to. The only thing, the only problem that I have now is the water intake. Um, yeah. But I'm trying to eat more better. Um, and that other good stuff. But yeah, Meluka does assist in because of the amazing foods that they have, the snacks, the vitamins, the um, health um, thingamajigs. Okay, this is the floor polish. This, you don't need to add no water. You just hold it like this and spray it out along the floor. And then you use the white head mop, the white, the white head part, and, and use it to polish your floor. So I'm, gonna, I'm excited to try that one. Cause I've never polished my floor. I just clean it and swiffer it and stuff. But now we have a polish. Okay, so now I'm gonna demonstrate to you guys one tiny little thing. So you know, your for the cleaners, they come in these bottles. I have like all the bottles. I don't know if it's eight to ten bottles. I have no, not eight to ten, six to eight bottles. They're all like this, and they all have their own um, stickers on them. This is for the tub and tub and tile. This is for, this is no work. So you know when you're in the shower and the next person has to come in, we have no time to be cleaning down the whole shower. So we take this bottle, go get the one that looks like this like this. It says no work. We get, we just take this bottle and it comes with, um, it doesn't come with, you have to actually get the, actually yeah, it does. This whole set here is $1.99, which is pretty cheap because you don't throw it away, you keep this all you have to do is just keep refilling it, refilling it. And the fillers, it comes in a bottle like this, a little bit bigger than this. Um, and this is also 12 time, 12 X concentrated. So um, we take the bottle, you find it, Luki? It says no work. So um, this is 12 X here. So on the bottle, it says 12 X. You see that much product right here. You found it? I found this. I don't know where spray bottle is. Anita said Splash H H20 is my son's favorite juice. My mom says my mom way of up, upping his water intake daily. That okay, that that's true too. If I have flavor in my water, I'll drink water more often and it's natural, I'm guessing. Okay, so no work, it comes in this bottle. So they're about the same size. See? So what we do with this is we pour it in like this. A little bit more. Okay, so this, look at this. That's all the liquid that you need to put in here up to the 12X. And then it has a fill line, the line that you put to it. It says fill, that's when you put up the water up to. So the cleaner is here, and then the fill line is here. Lucas, my little handyman, will put that in. Don't run the water too hard because it will make bubbles and foam. So just run it um, soft. You can use a kettle of water if you want. And then that's it. So we put the water in, we put this, this thing on, and then when we come out of the shower, we just spray it for the next person. And I don't think that one you have to rinse, actually. Am I right, Anita? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think that one we have to rinse. There's tub and tile for when you're actually cleaning the tub. It comes in a bottle like this also, but it says tub and tile on it. And then you spray it, and then you could just um, wash it down and rinse it down with the with the what with the hose head, with the shower head. Sorry. Uh, did I give him the right bottle? Jesus God. Oh yeah, I did. Okay, you finish. Okay, so Lucas is finishing up with that. And that's how all of my cleaners are. For the bathroom, for the disinfectant, I don't use bleach. 
because I have bad lungs, so I don't usually use, I don't buy bleach. I'll show you my disinfectant for one. This is my disinfectant, it's called Solulard, and it also comes in a bottle like this. And <clears throat> it comes, it's, this one is, you just put it up to the two. The two X is here. So you put that much, that much um, Solugard in the bottle, and then the rest up to here would be water. And then we just mix it. This, when you're, when you're cooking in the kitchen, like chicken, any kind of meat, like um, just a disinfect period. When people come in and out of my house, I use a paper towel, I spray the paper towel and I wipe it down. Just This gets rid of, I think, 99% worth of germs. I don't use Lysol, I don't use other um, um, stuff with bleach and those other harsh chemicals because, okay, so. Anita said, no work is no work. Spray and walk away and it makes it easier to clean as well. Yeah, there you go. See? So there you go. I don't know why the water looks so foggy, but thank you, Lucas. So this is no work. He filled it up to the fill line and then I had the product down to here So if he goes into the shower now and he comes out, Lucas has to just spray it and as Anita said, walk away Walk away You know, walk away <laughs> Okay, so that's this one hmm? Yeah, I know Listen, Tough and Tender also comes in a bottle like this and the tough and tender, one bottle makes one, two, three, four, five, six. So one of this makes six of this. You know how much of this stuff I have, and I don't go to the store to buy cleaner. I'm not even lying. If I show you guys my, I show you guys my stash the other day. I don't go outside to buy cleaner. This is my natural stuff. I clean my stove. Yes, my stainless steel stove. I clean it with this. So every time you cook. And there's oil that splashes if you make like fried chicken or fried foods and it splashes on the wall or the, um, the overhead. I spray this and I'm not, I'm not, I'm not lying guys. I will wait three minutes. I will just pack away my dishes that I just washed and I will wipe and it will be clean. I have something in there this morning that Lucas um, was soaking because it was meat left in there. And I pour out the water I said in here we don't soak. Huh? Hmm? I was soaking it. Oh, Shiloh. Shiloh was soaking it because he's a kitchen manager. So he was soaking it. I said, we don't soak in here. Take this tough and tender, spray it, and just leave it. And trust me, when you come back, you're just, you, there's no scrubbing or anything. We're just cleaning it off. I mean, you have to put a little elbow in there sometimes, depending on how, much, how long it's been sitting there. But this cleans Listen, I use it for my walls. I use it for the heaters. You know when the, the dust collects on there? You spray it and wipe it off right away and it, it, looks, it looks brand new. This thing. And I also use this. Wait for it. I also use this to clean my fruits and vegetables. This here, you'll put... Um, okay, somebody did it with grapes the other day. I did it with my nectarines that I bought for the boys. You can even use it with the apples. Put them in a thing of water. And then you pour some of the, um, or you can even spray it, some of the tough and tender. That's why it's called tough and tender. It's good to clean your fruits and vegetables and you'll see all the dirt and the res residual stuff coming off of your food that you're putting in your stomach. We? Um, Anita said it's it's a hospital grade disinfectant, just natural thyme and citrus oil. Exactly. So you imagine hospital grade and I have it in my house. And I don't, I didn't have to go to the store. I got it shipped right to my door yesterday. So every month, I don't, I don't need this every month because I have a few in there. But whatever I need, I just shop here. <coughs> and that's it. So like I said, for your kitchen, the bathroom, the kids' rooms when they have marker and all those nasty marks on their walls and stuff, just spray the tough and tender. Lucas used it in his room the other day when he cleaned it. His heater was like dust, had dust on it. You know when the dust just settles? Spray it. And you don't have to go like this. It's one wipe. That's that's how good this thing is. Tough and tender. And it comes with a bottle like this. And one bottle of this makes six or seven, two, four, seven bottles of this. Look at this. 
one bottle of this makes seven bottles of this okay um yeah i talked about the the disinfectant this has time the time i it has a nice smell to it too so anytime we cook in here i don't have to um get out the clorox wipes or the bleach or anything i just especially when we cook chicken you know how chicken when you're cleaning it it kind of splashes here and there so i just clean off the the the, um, the top the water top um, I spray the sink, I do the countertops. Anything I touch in the kitchen with my hands, I will use this. And even now, if the kids, if you go outside, I'll wipe down the um, the doors and the doorknobs just to get rid of the germs because these are trying times. I ain't, I know about that life. Um, Anita says, so you guard, it's all I'm using to disinfect my home during this virus. Yep, that's it. I don't use anything else. I'm, I promise you, I use nothing else. And <clears throat> we all know time is a, 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 a disinfectant too, a natural one. So I have everything in here. I have cleaners, I have disinfectants, I have food, I have laundry detergent, I have soap for the kitchen. I have, oh, I bought a little something for myself too. I bought a little lipstick. I don't usually wear lipstick, but I thought this, I never tried their stuff before, but look at the color. I don't want to put it on my dry lips. Oh, I don't want to use my hand either, but... And then hold it. And it's like a little magnet. Like, look how it sucks it in. See? So I bought that for myself. And some other stuff. You don't need to see that other stuff. And I have my pumps for my other laundry stuff. My pump. I don't know what this pump is for. Oh, it's for my tub and tile. Which Shania is going to use soon because, <clears throat> coincidentally, <coughs> coincidentally, um, somebody cleaned the bathroom and all of a sudden, the bottles just disappeared. I couldn't find the tub and tile and I could not find the no work, coincidentally. So I had to buy two more. So, yeah, these are it. So I'm going to refill this one. I already feel this one is going to go in the bathroom by the shower. And say two. And I bought myself some wipes. Yeah. So that's my long haul. That is everything. I think I got most of the stuff that I have in my house. Um, yeah, that's it. Any other questions, Shiloh? Marsha said, and it's safe for, um, he said, and it's safe for the children too. It's safe for children and pets, elderly. Like anybody who has skin and, and a heartbeat, it's good for those, for, for everybody. I am so sick. I like, I don't know, but everything always just falls on me for some reason. So I tend to go the natural way. My daughters are going green. They don't use, they don't, and they do a lot of recycling. <clears throat> See, like I'm always um, gagging all the time. I don't know if I need some water or something, but um, I have bad lungs, so I don't use the, the bleach too tough. I love the smell of bleach, but I can't use it. So I have to use my natural products. So I think that is it. Do you guys need, have, um, want to ask any more questions? Shiloh, how come I see so much comments and you're not reading me nothing? Well, she said that Anita said, yes, Marsha, it's all safe and natural. Everything can, everything can be used together. Yeah. And if your kids get into it, even um, not that we want it to happen, but just say you leave on the, it's at ground level and you have babies and they get into it. If they put, uh, if they even eat it, I mean, they'll have an upset stomach, but they ain't gonna die from it, depending on how much they drink. If they just, you know, some people, it, if, if I put my finger in this and I lick my finger, it won't do anything to me. That's how natural this stuff is, but we don't encourage to drink cleaner, but I'm just saying, if your children happen to get into it, because notice there's no child safety locks on it, and why is that? Because it's all natural um, ingredients, and one too much of one thing is not good so you know that if your child drinks a whole bottle they're gonna get an upset stomach obviously but if they just get into it and they wipe their hand in their mouth it's not detrimental but just give them water and wash it down because that's how safe our products are so i think that's it i'm gonna let shallow do his um finish his kitchen duty he brought out the recycling bin and then he brought it back upstairs he did the dishes his things are in the um in the sink that he's gonna wash out. I did a video before, so I'll do a, a video of after of how 
um, easy it is to clean with the um, tough and tender. And then he's gonna mop the floor and that's it. That's it, then we'll have free time. <laughs> so that's it. Any more questions? Oh, bye. You're, you're here, so watch boy, go sit down. <laughs> okay, so, <clears throat> yeah, that's it. So it was actually fun showing you guys my little stash. Um, haven't been on live like in a minute. Give me that phone there, Shiloh. I could start doing it now. Okay. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think Michelle got all the questions. So we're looking at myself. Look, 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 look at yourself. Look at yourself. Okay, so that's it. So guys, if you have any questions, and just in case you want to know where I get all this stuff from, it's Meluca. Um, It's my little shopping market that I, that I shop from every month. Not just for these stuff. They have like over 400 plus products. So I shop for um, any, and, any and every little thing. Uh, yeah, so that's it. Marsha said that she'll be joining today, and then Anita said, yay, Marsha, welcome. <laughs> okay, that's good. I'll call you in a bit, Marsha. Um, I'm going to put away all this stuff and put my, my um, I just got a brain fog. I'm going to put away all my products, and then the boys are going to eat a snack out of their, um, their basket. And then Shell's gonna finish up his stuff and then we're gonna probably watch a movie or something. After I after I link up, after I call Marsha. So if you guys have any questions or would like to know more about know more about my, my little shopping club, um just inbox me and let me know. Or you could write it here if you want. But um no pressure and no, I'm not forcing anybody. It's it's up to you, but I just want to show you the, the kind of stuff that I have in my house and how amazing these stuff are. Anita said, don't forget the marketplace. Oh, and the marketplace also. Um, like when you shop at certain places like um, outside stores, like online or whatever, you get back um, points so you can shop. Use those um, dollars to purchase stuff in the Maluka, um market too. Those stuff will all be explained if you um, want more information. And then she said, discounts on lots of other stores. For Maluka customers. Yeah, exactly. So Maluka is not just for for here. If you go outside, you, you experience a lot of good perks too. So like I said, um, if you want any more information, thank you very much, Anita, for assisting me today. I really appreciate it. So, ow! Because I couldn't really elaborate too much. But thank you. All the, mo Most of what Anita said and what I want to say is some of it is written in the, um, the comments. So you can just go over the comments and look. And that's it. I'm gonna find something to clean because you know me, I'm always cleaning. I'll just take a little two minute rest and then we'll get out. We didn't go for a walk this morning, but Shao will finish his chores and then we will go for a walk after that. Okay? So I will see you guys on another live. Maybe I will make a VIP group and invite you guys um, in it so you can see all the good stuff that happens in my house. Okay, so. Once again, thank you guys for joining and much appreciated. I will see you guys on the flip side. Bye.